morning everyone welcome to today's vlog hope you're all okay yeah it's been another wet blustery day up there unfortunately yeah <laughs> looking out the window and you can see the trees are going like that really really blustery thing is with the wind you don't know if it's going to cause any damage whether you can lose any roof tiles off your roof or that sort of thing so yeah i know we did have a storm catherine at the weekend i'm not too quite sure if this is a named storm or not really really don't know now, hang on a second let me sort this camera out that's better but yeah the um tripod seems to be getting a bit stuck at the minute i need to get Stephen to look at it so but anyway yeah kids are absolutely fine they're happy watching animal park on the bbc iplayer again i think it used to be on bbc one not too quite sure if it is but um like i said they're definitely happy watching that so yeah love to go down to Longleat where it's filmed it's been a good 20 no i don't even have the voice actually to be honest with you. so it's 19 in, in december so yeah it's gonna be a good 20 22 years since i last went so i bet it's changed so much the only problem is it's down near bath area so it's all, if you're somewhere in that location it's always good to go so so to see if and maybe you can arrange a trip there during the summer holidays or something like that so are you thinking is that we need the weather when it's wet miserable you don't fancy looking around all these places outside do you to be honest with you but i have to admit visiting the theme park in the rain is actually good because it does actually keep the queue line time waiting times down so but anyway yeah like i said plans for today we're not really really doing much we're obviously just going to take the boys swimming later we went last week and they absolutely loved it so we're going back again it's up to local gym so it's not too bad actually to be honest with you because obviously me and Stephen the members we just use a membership game for free so just end up paying for the boys so yeah they do guarantee you at least an hour if and if it's not busy you do get more see like last week we got hour and a half which wasn't too bad so we got there um just slightly before it opened so we had the third color wristband so i think that's why you end up with an hour and a half I think we could probably stopped in longer, but after an hour and a half, Ben just simply got up and headed to the showers like he'd had enough. But yeah, the spa bath last week was really, really nice. So hopefully, of course, that's open as well. And it really, really did help my foot. But anyway, yeah, um, today I just, obviously now I just need to do a dishwasher. Again, it's just unloading it and putting all the breakfast things back in, basically. Last little bit of washing to get done. It's not an awful lot. So get that done, stick that on the air I'll make myself a cup of tea but now I need to give Ben his last of his medication and then we can start Tuesday. Now my wheels in motion and my windows open with the wind blowing in my head. I'm driving down the highway, gonna do this my way. I can feel it in the air. Here I go. Yeah, so you can see what I mean by it being a bit blustery out here. I love now the pigeons can actually stay in the trees to be when it's when it's blowing. But yeah, like I said, also the trees have started to blossom now. It took their time actually. They normally blossom way, way, way before now. Um, unfortunately, the garden was drying out a bit, but now because it's actually turned into a bit of a bog again, unfortunately. But at least we managed to cut the grass before all the rain happened. But you wait, we'll end up need to cut in the grass again unfortunately so yeah um but at least it's stopped raining now i'm hoping fingers crossed we can get the sunshine it's going to be over there somewhere a little bit as well so yeah, anyway comment down below if you saw the solar eclipse where you are obviously we should have been able to see it in the uk and ireland yesterday unfortunately again it started to rain so we didn't i think next time uk is going to get a full eclipse like they had in america was 2090 so but they do say we can get a partial eclipse 2026 or something so that's quite interesting we do but yeah you can sit with over there where the trees are blowing so yeah bless the near ben bless the near ben so hello mr pigeon what's the matter you going flying away <laughs> 
Yeah, so there's so many stuff sort of already now, which is good. Um, I was realising I couldn't find the, the other big swimming bag because we've got two of these. And I just realised the other one's still at school because obviously Ben's been swimming at school and obviously they keep his kit there because obviously they wash and dry it at school as well. It helps, helps keep their life skills. So yeah, I was wondering where that one was. So what I've done is managed to squeeze most of it into the big bag and then there's got a couple of little bits in the other swimming bag as well. Yeah, this is Bruce, how this one was. This is from London 2012 when we had the Olympics over here. So yeah, it's, it's last is a test of time. We did have two, the other one split, so we threw that one away, but at least we've still got that one. So yeah, come back in here, Ben's happy. Aren't you, sweetheart? Are you on your ball bouncing? You know your ball, don't you? Put your lights on. Ben, you put your lights on? Yeah? So he's doing his exercises on this ball. It's, way, it's, it's crazy because we bought that ball for us. Well, like for me, it seems so we could do like some exercises here and stuff like that. But Ben collared it because I think he's got one at school and it is good for him actually because I said he always bounces on there and he sends his piece is um bean batting over him and bought him for Christmas. It was it was nice and it was nice and round. You can see that's a pound of cake now. I think we need to actually get some more balls for it to refill it because there's pop for the balls and stuff in it. But again, with this when he jumps on it and climbs all over it and stuff. We're yeah, just watching theme park well, why now, right? Well, Sammy, the Synap Road's not open now, is it, for the rest of the year? They're re I don't know if they're re-theming it or something, I really do not know, like, but yeah, um, Ben loves that road, but it does get a little bit boring in there, so nice if they could re-theme it. Anyway, Ben, should you put your lights on? Ready? Ready for your lights? There we go. Yeah, put your lights Hey, Ben, are we going to swim in later? Ben, are we swimming in a bit? Yeah, you love your swimming, don't you? You swim like a fish when you move in the water. Last week when we went, obviously he had his woggle and... Yeah! Mum, this is my favourite. Hey, are you swimming? Oh, like I said, yeah, he had his woggle float round and he was kicking and moving away like a fish, basically. So, the only thing is, I have to admit, with the pool, when they've got the... Because obviously they've got, like, the big... Pool and they've also got like a learner pool, next not learner pool, like a wave pool type thing. And when the waves are on, it affects the other pool as well. So, obviously, when the waves are on, you can't do your proper swim because you would like bob up and down. But yeah, anyway, but anyway, we'll get you some lunch soon. Yeah, you have see, you right? Yeah, if then you could talk and tell us what you're thinking, eh, Ben? So, yeah. We're just in the car, just heading up to for simmer now. So, are we looking forward to simmering again? Yeah. Yeah? That's good. Yeah, it's, I guess you can see, yeah, it's always good for something to do because, like I said, it's the weather is yeah, the greatest. All depends on the weather, Sammy, doesn't it? If it's raining, not good if it's raining, are you, darling? Because everything out there is all outside. It's what I say, we're just planning it by day by day now, our days, because of the weather and stuff. But anyway, what's that? 155 for fuel. That's expensive. Why is it going up so high? That's what happened to the Sainsbury's. It's one, was it the Sainsbury's? It's 130. 139. That's expensive. That's crazy cost for fuel. It really, really is. But anyway, Ben, you ready for swimming? Ready to get splash, splash, splash in the pool? Yeah. No, Ben, you're probably not going in the spa bath, but never mind. So, yeah. So yeah, we had a nice swim. It's about an hour and twenty minutes though, wasn't it? Wasn't, wasn't so long as last week, which, but obviously it was busy, which is fair enough. They do guarantee at least now anyway. They get the extra, it's the bonus. So yeah, really, really busy, but a really good fun swim. Really, really enjoyed it. Did you enjoy your swim today? Did you like your swim? Yeah, you fall in love with the spa bath, haven't you? Again, okay, we went in there for a little bit, and then um. Obviously, it took him out back into normal pool and he got off and take him straight to the spa bath. Must be that spa bath is nice though, isn't it? It is really nice. Beds of fresh and... What? Yeah. It, that's the thing. It's sort of... Well, it seems it allows four people in it. A bit of a squeeze, though, isn't it? Like, it's a nice little bit bigger. I know Ben will love one at home. So, did you like the spa bath? It's nice, isn't it? It's nice and warm in there as well. It is really, really good, actually. Like I said, it seems to be really, really helpful for his back. So, and then I like to add because it's my foot. So, yeah, anyway, like I said, we're just, um, no problem is like I said, just getting my hair dry now. But let's dry naturally. Again, if I want to dry it at the pool, it's 50p to dry your hair. 
um, I'm going to put my hair dryer the next time. So, but anyway, yeah, so like I said, we're just going to pop down to St. Fizzle Tesco. So I don't know which one I'm going to go to yet. Um, Sammy wants Scottish pie for tea, did you? And sadly, I forgot to get the lids out of the freezer last night. So, but yeah, yeah like I said, we're just getting some fresh one anyway. So, yeah, so that's what we're going to have tea later on. Right, I guess I'll give it to Daddy. Blessing you, Ben's just picked a Ribena. Sam, do you want to drink after swimming? Yeah, yeah which one do you want? You're on the way, so yes, but you need to pay for it no, first, Mia. I want the Ribena. You want the Ribena as well, yeah? Daddy. Mummy wants a fizzy Daddy. Fanta. There you go, Dines. I love a fizzy Fanta. You must be the awful one, don't you? Why, was it me? Is Ribena fizzy? No, mm -hmm. Ribena's not fizzy. I can do the thing. So, yes, yeah, anyway, like, so we're just in Tesco, just getting a couple of bits. Something like I said, don't need an awful lot, really. I'm just a bit of a top mm -hmm. up shop. Keep running away from the Chris, not Ben's like with Chris. Ben, do you want your crisps or not? Yeah. Ben, yeah. want your crisps? If you get a drink, one of the things as I said, if you get a drink oh, as a sandwich, we're not at work tomorrow, are you? Just look and see, I'd see those are gluten free ones on offer, but they're not, they're just the normal ones. Tell what, they are Sorry, really man. nice actually. Sorry, start getting the bits for skip. Do you want, what do you want, spaghetti bolognese? That'd be easy for Mum to cook to No, you. I want shepherd's pie. You, what do you want shepherd's pie for? Yeah. Let's just get a bolognese no, instead. No, shepherd's pie. Okay, shepherd's pie, okay, that's fine. <laughs> Don, do you want some onions? 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 No, it's quite funny actually, we don't need I onions. Don't need onions. No, we don't need we've got we loads. Smell onions? Yeah, <laughs> we've um, got a two good to go box, haven't we, from Al, no, from Morrison's on Sunday, and we've got two kilograms worth of onions in there. And so we've got a whole load, again, with fruit, don't need their fruit. We've got a whole load of strawberries and grapes and oranges, all for £6.18. Definitely was worth it, really, Thank really was. Well, so I don't need any of that stuff. Thank you for shopping. It's something you can shop at Tesco's, doesn't it? I'll tell you what I am going to get. I've got nothing there. I've got some skate there for 28 p That might be worth getting some, because I know we need some of that anyway. You sure you don't want Shepherd's Park? You sure you don't want me to do a lasagna? I want Shepherd's Pie. You want Shepherd's Pie? Should we not escape from No. I'm not going to stop him, am I? What have they got in the reduced price section here? Not an awful lot, actually. We've got apples, which have got, like I said, we've got plenty of them at home. Sometimes you can find there's loads and loads of good things in there sometimes, can't you? No, um, no, nothing there. Not, not for long, we're not. No, just to get the couple of bits that we need. So, we tell you what we do need, Sammy. Mm -hmm. We need some mints, don't we? If we want shepherd's pie, we we'll do some mints. Come on then, Ben, you all right? Oh yeah, that ham we got went off, didn't it? That's it, scan it. That's it, tell you what, it's in the um, scanning shop, so much easier for these, because obviously we've got bags in the car, we keep our bags in the car anyway. So yeah, so just get some mints, yeah. Put those, that's it, so. Not again, I mean, like I said, not an awful lot in here actually. Where's so, got that in the mint. Oh, they moved on oh, mint, seems to be that. Oh, they changed it. Okay. They changed the mint. Let's have a look at the mint. Mint is there. Yeah, I put the mint in the mint, sort there is. So, yes, I just got home from Tesco's. Got those few bits we got cost us 48 quid. It's just crazy, isn't it, how much it costs? Hello. I know we've got a couple of bits of Ben for gluten free. Obviously, you've got him the cereal, got my cup packets of biscuits, and you also got some of his tray baked by things he likes. Must admit, though, the mince was £5 just for this mince here, which was just crazy price, really, how much it was. But yeah, like I said, that's what Sammy asked for for Shepherd's Pie. And not only that, if I do it with the gluten free gravy, a bit for Ben, he's got something free for lunchtime tomorrow or something for tea tomorrow, as need. Because obviously, um, make fun enough to have a him. So, yeah, but I'm saying that though, I don't mind doing it if I know the kids are going to eat it. What? Well, is if I cook something, they don't eat what? Well, yeah, put Ben's here in his little container. Tell what, they are really, really good, those little con seals containers. Um, what's that? I don't know. I don't know. One of the phones has just made a weird noise. Yeah, I upgraded my phone. Not actually upgraded my phone. I've got the same phone, but I've done an update for it. And ever since then, every notification that comes up the same, it's just I need to find out if I can actually um, but take about the settings and stuff like that. So anyway, yeah, I think I'm doing the shepherd's pie now for Sammy. Sammy, I'm going to do your shepherd's pie now, all right? Yeah, we've got a too good to go 
I was about to say bag, but it was a box, was it, from Morrison's mm. on Saturday, on Sunday. Got two big, massive bottles. Yeah, look at the size of these onions. Got some really big ones. I've got two kilograms worth in the carriage, actually, to be honest with you. And you've got some really, really big mushrooms and got a whole load of carrots. So I thought, right, instead of using the frozen ones, I used the fresh ones up to save waste in them. Um, but yeah, I also got some parsley. It was quite, actually quite short to do with the parsley. Don't know whether to add it, we can have it into mint or add it on top of the mashed potato to be honest because I think parsley is more of a decoration though isn't it or is that coriander I'm not too quite sure that's why I select what, she's, what she says in a minute it's a bit unlucky here so cook crushed garlic and chili together to take off the heat but you yeah yeah, I finished using the spice, yeah. So anyway, we'll find out what to do with that in a minute as well. But yeah, like I said, we need to pay £6.18 for these two big massive boxes. No way of the line, they're about this big. They're about this big, that's absolutely full with loads and loads of things in there, wasn't that? Loads of yeah, fruit. I won't get them all the time, because sometimes it can be yeah I will get them all the time it's only because I saw them on the app and I thought oh I'll just give them a go it's only because I saw someone on Facebook had them and I thought they got a really good offer but saying that though we've got loads of strawberries didn't we? we've got the t we've got three of the big massive pellets of strawberries about this big we've used one of those already and you can't see my head came because I'm talking and um and then also we've got like four packet four big tubs of the um pellets of grapes and they've been really nice but anyway yes get on with doing the veg um, for so some Sammy's shepherd's pie. is our shepherd's pie um there's ben's there as well so yeah put that parsley on the top like i said you can cook it in the oven so i know what sam is going to say he's going to say what's that green thing on the top so yeah so that is plenty there for ben for two days and obviously this is mine and sammy's as well so what two three different types of cheese so this was the mature one that was the normal one but it's weird how they've all gone totally different anyway you can just cheese up now for us probably for the get cold so yeah, it's gonna be quite interesting what it's like with the parsley again it's the first time we've had parsley for the end of the so yeah what's well, so this is like you know Bendy did your dinner up in a minute for your tat well as she found brings Tuesday to an end yeah we had a wonderful swim this afternoon looks like loads and loads of people had the same idea today because it was absolutely <laughs> chewing out the door when we got there and uh, once the first hour had gone by there was a queue waiting at the swimming pool ready to come in again so it just shows you how popular the swimming sessions are don't they, those it's ones. good because it, like you said these people will go on with it like when we went last week um, it was busy but it wasn't that busy. <laughs> it wasn't that busy, but we were today. You could tell it was busy, but like I said, because um looked like they let so many people in, didn't they? Then at two o'clock they let everybody else in. Part of me thinks we should try and go for the two o'clock hour next time because it seems to be the quietest hour. It did do actually, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, like I said, they probably was quiet. But I wonder, what is it with Ben and the spa bath? 
Yeah. He absolutely loves the spa bath, doesn't he? I'll tell you what, you can't go wrong with a good old spa bath, can you? You can't. Especially your bubbles and everything. It's, a, mm. thing is you, <laughs> it's funny because you don't know when you let off yourself, do you? Stuff like that, you know what I mean? <laughs> That'd be quite funny. Comment down below if you love when you go to a swimming pool, if you love going into a spa bath. Yeah, we absolutely love it. Ben does. The only issue with that wood in that swimming pool, it's a bit too tiny. I think it's only supposed to be for like two people, isn't it? Two or three people, but yeah. <coughs> like I said, the kids have to, the kids loved it in there. It's like with Ben, he knows what he wants, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah, anyway, yeah, so that does another day. Like the video, comment down below, hit the subscribe button, see you in the next one. Bye, Bye, everybody. Everybody.